underground fitness meetup that we started some years back where we used to have teams meet up and we, would, we have these different competitions and so on and so forth. It kind of died out maybe about three or four years ago. Bar Wars, which is like a, a subculture from Strength Wars, which is from Bodybuilding Revolution. And the one-on-one -on -one aspect was being re, you know, reintroduced. So we just kind of piggybacked off of the momentum of the Bar Wars concept, and the, which was basically our, our concept in the, you know, from back in the day, but moving forward with a one-on-one -on -one momentum um, and giving guys a different opportunity. The difference that we have now is that we try to line people up against people who we think are good matches for them in terms of their height, their weight, their skill set, so that it's a sprinter against a sprinter, a marathon run against a marathon run. You know what I'm saying? So you really get to see how good a person is based on what they're good at, not just creating a, a linear um, uh, concept where everybody should have to do it, you know, which is fine. Those are still foreign concepts, but we're just trying to come up with something a little bit different, you know? So that's basically what the bar club introduces now, and I think people are starting to like it, you know, giving them a, a, a fresh feel, being able to showcase their talents. When lose the draw, it's really like a, 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 an honor to be able to be showcased in that way, you know what I'm saying? It's, it really takes a lot to break these elements, to go one-on-one, -on -one, to take on a you know what I'm saying? You know how it is. It's really rough to do those things. So it's, it's just a lot of respect for the athletes from day one. But we got Paige. Um, Spartan. She's very, very strong. She's um, she's going up against Vinique. Vinique is not well known. She doesn't have a crew. Uh, she trains at the gym I work out at, and I train at sometimes. And I saw her in there doing some pull-ups. She was doing a lot of pull-ups one day. Then I saw her doing L-sits. Then I seen her doing dips and then weighted pull-ups. I'm like, all right, this girl is strong. Let's see if we can get her in the ball club. And she was down with the idea because she wanted to promote strength for women. Uh, the routine is crazy. 50 weighted sit-ups, then 50 weighted squats, holding a, a, I told them it was a 45 pound plate, but it's really gonna be a 25 pound plate. Then they gotta do 25 dips and then 25 pull-ups, you know? And the problem with all of that is we did not anticipate it being as cold in the beginning. So holding on to the cold steel bars in this weather is really gonna be difficult. Uh, right now it's about 30 degrees, the wind chill factor makes it feel like the teens. So, yeah, it's, it's way colder than we expected. This is colder than the winter reps competition by far, you know? So this is the real winter reps competition today. Yeah, the two guys are, one guy, he's walking in the park right now. His name is Snoop. He's from Spartans. He also trains with the Barbarians. Um, he's very, very strong. And I'll give you insight on both of those guys. The other guy is Jay Lethal. He used to be with um, Team Gator. He's from Harlem. Um, he doesn't really have a team affiliation right now. But that was who he was down with. And to me, Jay has an incredible first burst. Like his right out the gate strength is really good. His punch is pretty good. Uh, like Zeph likes to say, he has a great one, two, right? But Snoop has a great one, two, three. What I mean by that is if he paces himself, he can go very, very long. And that might benefit him in a competition like this. Reason being, but they're, but they're all dips, 25 pull-ups, 40 dips, 20 pull-ups, 30 dips, 15 pull-ups, 20 dips, 10 pull-ups, 10 dips, 5 pull-ups, and then 20 muscle-ups. That is a long, grueling routine. But I'll, I'll tell you this, I know for a fact uh, Snoop can get that thing done in less than 20 minutes, and, uh, and that's impressive. And that's kind of what it's about, is having the, uh, the endurance. Not just the strength, the endurance. Uh, I don't know. It's neither one of these guys are experienced when it comes to competition. So yeah, I don't know. It's a toss-up. I don't know how this one's gonna play out. But they both trained really long for it. They had a long time in terms of preparation. <laughs>